Afraid of God? No. But I'm afraid of you. Are you going to just sit there? As compared to what? Standing? Not standing. Rowing. Rowing? Hadn't planned on it. So you expect me to show What's the this? burden? No, but I do expect you to do all the rowing. And why is that? Coming here was your idea. My idea? I've made it very clear that I don't believe in the exercise. The rowing? No. Imagine that's wonderful exercise. Then what? The entire thought experiment. Excuse me. How much longer? One goes into an experiment knowing one could fail. But one does not undertake an experiment knowing one has failed. Can we get back to the rowing? I suggest you do. No. We're never going to get there. No, I mean I'd greatly appreciate it if you would assist. Perhaps you should ask him. I imagine he has a greater interest in getting there than I do. I suppose he does, but there's no point in asking. Why not? Because he doesn't row. He doesn't row? No, he doesn't row. Ah, I see what you mean. We've arrived. Shall we tell him when we'll be returning? With that chain in him. It might give him some comfort. Well, at least that's something we can agree on. Hey! Is somebody meeting me here? I'd certainly hope so. It does seem like a dreadful place to be stranded. Well, maybe there's someone inside. Excuse me, it's Booker DeWitt. I guess you're expecting me? Is anyone here? Hello?
demand that card. Expect me to sit in their fancy chair. So, uh, the hell? Go! Make yourself ready, Pilgrim. The buying beans are there as a safeguard. No, 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 God damn it! Attention! Ascension in the count of five. Count of four. No, no, no. Three, two, one. Ascension. Ascension. Five thousand feet. Ten thousand feet. Fifteen thousand feet. Hallelujah. Excuse me, where am I? Heaven, friend. Or as close as we'll see till Judgment Day. I just keep such questions to myself, unless I want to get made.
And every year, on this day of days, we recommit ourselves to our city and to our prophet, Father Comstock. We recommit through sacrifice and the giving of thanks and by submerging ourselves in the sweet waters of baptism. And lo, if the prophet has struck down our enemies at wounded need and not railed against the Sodom beneath us, it would have been enough. If the prophet had just railed against the Sodom beneath us, but not accept the three golden gifts of the founders, it would have been enough. If the prophet had just accepted the three golden gifts of the founders and not prayed for our deliverance, it would have been enough. If the prophet had only prayed for our deliverance and not led us to this new Eden, it would have been enough. If the prophet had just led us to the new Eden and not purged the vipers of the Orient, it would have been enough if the prophet had just purged the vipers of the Orient, but not suffered the sack. Is it someone new? Someone from the Sodom below? Newly come to Columbia to be washed clean before our prophet, our founders, and our lord? I just need passage into the city. Passage to the city. Brother, the only way to Columbia is through rebirth in the sweet waters of baptism. Will you be cleansed, brother? Hey, I'm just looking to pass through. Take his head. <laughs> hey, I baptize you in the name of our prophet, in the name of our founders, and the name of our Lord. <laughs> I don't know, brothers and sisters. But this one doesn't look clean to me. Who's there? Who's there? Bring us the curb and wipe away the dead! What do you want? We have a deal to it! Open this door right now! I told you! I'm not gonna do it! Priest needs to learn the difference between baptizing a man and drowning one. I need to find a landmark and figure out where the hell I am. Above all nations. To Father Franklin, a key of gold so that Eden might have. Our prophet fills our lungs with water, so they may better love the air. He who crossed the Delaware with flaming sword and wings of angels. A rebel against Eden. By the sword and the scroll. And the key. Amen. Just because the city flies don't mean it ain't got its fair share of fools. All right. Still got a girl to find. Capture oh, Father Comstock's past and Salt all right, I tell you. Says he's for faith, family, and father. Who can be against all that? Never hire an artist, my dear fellow. They are a temperamental and unreliable lot to a man. I told him that the park is exceedingly far behind. is half finished, but the statuary hasn't arrived. The fountain is full of rain. God's 
sake. Even the marigolds are still unplanted. All work which should have been done months ago. Do you know? And then the archangel showed a vision. A city lighter than air. I asked her, why do you show this to me, archangel? I'm not a strong man. I'm not a righteous man. I am not a holy man. And she told me the most remarkable thing. You're right, prophet. But if grace is within the grasp of one such as you, how can anyone else not see it in themselves? Good day, citizen. You're looking fit. Picking the right event to attend on a day like today is serious business, you know. You can't be everywhere. Columbia Raffle and Fair. Huh. He's strong in the sword, but a bit weak in the key of the scroll, if you get my meaning. Warm system, eh? And light variable wind throughout the afternoon. In short. A beautiful day for the festivities, Columbia. And now, back to the music. Faint and radical on me, John. I do not want to be some character out of I Married a Box Popula, now do I? Yeah, that's where they said I'd find her. Telegram, Mr. DeWitt. Huh. Telegram for you, sir. DeWitt, stop. Do not alert Comstock to your presence, stop. Whatever you do, do not pick number 77, stop. Tess.
Would you care for a boutonniere? We're raising money for the girls' patriotic league. <laughs> Maybe next time. You'd look dashing with one in your lapel. Come back if you change your mind. A good day to you, sir. Hello. I agree. You keep saying that. Look at her. Ain't she some kind of beauty? You know. Would you believe me? Well, friends, I am here today to tell you. Those are no flights of fancy. You want to let me through here, pal? Uh, streets closed for your safety, fella. They're prepping tonight's fireworks back there. There's enough TNT back there to blow Peking to kingdom come. Again. Roadblock. Better find another way around. Who amongst you has tasted the divine gift of the vigor? One swig and feats of wonderment are at the tips of your fingers. You know our prophet is fair. You know our prophet is kind. And he has asked, personally asked Mr. Jeremiah Fink, to bring to you these amazing wonders. Praise be to our prophet, and praise be to our fair city. in science and wonder we've seen. Soon enough, Fink and Lutess will be sending folks to the moon. Wouldn't that be something? Oh, hot dogs, hot dogs, Alexander Hot, hot Dogs, Columbia. Hot Hear your voice from the past in the present. Say something, Sonny. What's a Voxaphone? 
What's a voxophone? Exactly that! A personal record of voice. Hey, just so we're clear, I'm not paying for this. Just a demonstration, sir. Have you sampled any of the new vigors here today? I usually wait till Fink works out the kinks with him and safer. Have you ever seen anything like it? It looks so sad. Sad? When you're that strong, what's there to be sad about? Dear friend, have you ever lost a penny to a vending machine? Give me one of those. With just a whisper, they're all ears. <laughs> Press to turn machines into allies. What the hell was that? Bet he could lift that entire booth over his Four flavors. That many? Howdy, sailor. What port do you call home? Any port in the storm? You know what I mean? I have a weakness for this ice cream business. Come on, let me through. Heads. Or tails. Huh. Tails. Told you. Hmm. I never find that as satisfying as I'd imagined. Chin up. There's always next time. I suppose there is. Vision got them. If we're gonna flush the Vox out of the Skyline system, then we gotta have the best. Uh -huh. They got any openings in the group? I'd love to bust some Vox skull. <laughs> your books on the sciences. Mama says it's not a fit occupation for a lady, but I think she's jealous of our cleverness. Is it true that only you are allowed to visit the girl in the tower? If the lamb is lonely too, I should like to meet her, as we would have much in common. Warmest regards, Constance.
officially begun! Mister! Mister! Sorry, no sale. <laughs> Silly. There's never a charge for the raffle. You've been sleeping under a rock? 77. 77. That's a lucky number. I'll be rooting for you. Bring me the bowl! Is that not the prettiest young white girl in all of Colombia? <laughs> all right, then. The winner is number 77! Well, what do you know? Number 77, come and claim your prize! First throw! Are you gonna throw it, or are you taking your coffee black these days? <laughs> oh, looks like we've got a shy one here. <laughs> we've got to do something about that. Wait, it's him. Now, where'd you get that brand, boy? Don't you know that makes you the backstabbing snake in the grass, false shepherd? And we ain't letting no false shepherd into our flock. <laughs> Show them what we got planned, boys! now turns machine and man into allies. Hold and release to create a ghostly trap.
getting hot. What's going on? No sample.
difference between life and death. Surprising. Surprising that it worked? Surprising that it didn't kill him. But a magnetic repulsive field around one's body can come in handy. If it doesn't kill you. A fair point. his biograph. Me. The man pays for exactly 100 pages in advance. Now, I'm half a Jew when I smell silver, so I say, I say, Father, your flock would pay for a thousand. You know, why well, settle for less? And then the prophet looks to me and says, 100 will suffice, as I know how it ends. Damn hook must be magnetized.
Otis works up at the lodge part-time. He took this box from one of their secret ceremonies. And I know for sure there is something dear inside. Problem is, Otis is more fool than not. He didn't bother to also secure a key from the Feathered Brothers to open the damn thing. And violence is not a foregone conclusion. Ah! Oh! Tim, the one they're after. Go. They're looking for you. Police! We're in need of your assistance! They're here! Shh! Keep your voice down.
Angel Columbia gave on to the founders the tools to build a new Eden, they did so without hesitation. For 85 years, they prepared the way of the Lord. But when the great apostate came, he brought war with him, and the fields of Eden were soaked with the blood of brothers. The only emancipation he had to offer was death. Doctor order. What exactly was the great emancipator emancipating the Negro from? From his daily bread, from the nobility of honest work, from wealthy patrons who sponsored them from cradle to grave, from clothing and shelter. And what have they done with their freedom? Why, go to Finkton and you shall find out. No animal is born free, except the white man. And it is our burden to care for the rest of creation.
afternoon, the scoundrel, believed now by many to be Vox Populi, began his terrible rampage. Trouble began almost instantly. Full of wrath and bent on harm, the anarchist maliciously wounded several Colombian peacemakers, before then arming himself and firing into an assemblage of virtuous fair-goers. As of this hour, 